Hi everyone, how's it going? Uh, so I got another mini album for you today. Uh, this one actually didn't take me too long because um, I use a lot of scraps and kind of a collage mini album is what I'll call it. And as most of you guys know, I'm not really good at collages, but I still like to try, you know. <laughs> and so before I get into the album, I will show you which paper stack I use. So I picked this up at Tuesday morning and I'm not quite sure how to say it. It's right here, Shamel, Shamil, I'm not sure, but this is why it's, <laughs> it is called Lovely Day Mini Album because, yeah, I'm not even going to try with that. And so, uh, anyways, let me get these scraps out of the way. Um, but it has some really cute um, color schemes in here. And so, uh, it looks like there's like luggage tags and uh, kind of like traveling or something like that just just always doing something kind of mini album but there's a lot of prints in here that I didn't use I only used about mm, I want to say eight to nine different sheets so there's still like two or three mini albums you can get out of this paper stack um, the way that I used it and so this one um, I did mess up I made the spine a little large because um, I was trying to do the same um, stack the deck binding but I wanted to make the gussets a little larger but totally messed up but it's cool because you know you just work with what you got I always say that <clears throat> so uh, the cover and the album are both uh, let me see seven inches by uh, I want to say five and a half yeah I, yeah they're five and a half because I, I took an eight by eight and a half by eleven piece of paper folded it with a little made a little pocket so anyways um I, I have a collection of homemade flowers here some dollar store uh flowers i got there some plastic embellishments that i got on ebay and just to, like the way you see this cover is pretty much the way the inside of the album is i did let me do a close-up on these um i did add some gold corners a sequin uh border here for, that i got from the dollar store I won um, these yellow ribbons on eBay and I added this. I got it from Joann's. Um, so there's the black sequin on top again. And these are from the paper collection. Um, and the spine is just some glitter paper with some flat back pearls. And the back is just a very shiny, foily piece of paper. And so um, the spine is three inches because I did want little wider gussets, but the only one that ended up being really wide is the middle one, which is alright because I wanted this to be a really chunky album that I could add flowers to because I haven't done that in a while. So for the front page, I have a little envelope here and I don't have anything in it. It's just for extra photos or extra anything else. And then I have a little pull out here that just says adventure and you can write on there. All right, for this page, uh, I did get these little stickers from AliExpress. They were for my planner, but I thought I'd use them in here because um, she's just so cute. So I added a little embossed border right here with some pearls and more stickers and some Valentine's um, chipboard that I had. Put that on there with a little um, see-through sticker. I've had in my stash for probably three years and I really, I forgot about it until I was looking for more jewels. And I was like, oh, might as well use those up. So when you flip it open, oh, I do have a little border punch up there. I don't know if you can see. Um, I just put some washi tape there so it's still flat. And then um, just kind of made a collection of collage of things on all these pages. So you see some dollar store stickers. There's not really a cartridge used in here. Actually, I don't think I used a cartridge at all. So it's mostly stickers and random stuff. So for this page, um, we got the dollar store sticker here, homemade flower, um, and I have some, uh, I had a banner, lace banner that I put back here, and then here's a crochet flower with some more flowers there, and then when you open this up, it opens that way, and there's those chipboard letters again, and that sticker, and then here's the back. And then um, you'll see a lot of these in there. I just put um, use my Martha Stewart punch around the page punch. And then some <clears throat> card candy that I made. Embellishments, I guess you should say. Oh, and all of these pages have the same insert. And so um, I always kick myself for not using 
corner punches because I have a ton and you can slide your photos in all the corners there and then in the back you could either add more photos or journaling but they're all the same and so for this page again the lace border with a little collection of flowers and another little girl right there uh, so for this one I just did a little photo mat with the little girl right there and there's a project life journaling tag back there but I just used it as the title and then I added some um, dollar store stickers some hearts that I had punched out on glitter paper and then um, another dollar store sticker with uh, these rib or these fabric flowers <clears throat> then when you open it up um, it just says the word enjoy and it is uh, open in the back so you can slide your photos there but of course I'm filming a video so it never works but anyways you can slide your photo in there and there's that banner I was talking about that I have and then I just add a morph paper and this is embossed with an embossing folder and then for this page um, a little uh, collage of borders down here some flowers and washi tape right there there's that sticker again I tried to use up so I didn't really put any photo mats down because you can pretty much put your picture wherever or multiple pictures um, and then when you open this up I have a little uh, embellishment highlight embellishment there and then um, some more dollar store stickers I tore some paper here in the corner added the little deer sticker so I think I really just try to use a lot of my stickers here and oops sorry I'm out of frame and so here's another uh, project life embellishment I had and I just put it on there because um, I had a lot of these flaps I kinda had to make some of the embellishments flat so here is the last page and I use a chipboard right here and I put some gold ink on there um, again crocheted flower up there plastic flower with some banners and then for this I used um, modeling paste I think that's what it is but anyways um, I put it on a stencil so it has a little texture kind of goes with the whole thing so um, yeah let me know what you guys think because like I said I'm, collages aren't my best um, thing to do but they are fun to do sometimes um, when you have the inspiration for it so I hope you guys enjoyed this album and I hope you guys have a wonderful day and happy scrapping bye